Thanks, a chaotic scene outside of Felix Morella High School today, a parking lot fight leading to a stabbing, sending three people to the hospital. Exclusive video tonight showing paramedics treating one of the victims on the scene. And tonight, all four people involved are facing felony charges for the after school fight. Local 10 News reporter Janine Stanwood is live at Kendall Regional Medical Center where three teens are recovering. Janine. And Calvin Laurie, we're told that two of those teens are actually students from different schools. We also spoke exclusively with a man who says he witnessed one of the stabbings. Now all four involved are in big trouble tonight. A frightening scene outside Felix Varela High School. <laughs> Police say a student stabbing three boys. One seen here on the sidewalk as others tend to him. I saw a boy with a knife and he stabbed the other one. This neighbor says he saw the attack. The blood right here. He had the blood here and he had his hands placed here like this and then they came to help him. Students snapping photos. This senior telling us he was in the middle of taking a test when in come police. Some cops came in like during my AP exam. We had immediately a, a police officer on campus uh, who responded and was able to call for support and uh, Miami-Dade police responded as well as multiple Miami-Dade schools police units and were able to apprehend the, uh, the subject. We were there as one young man was taken into custody and put into a Miami-Dade schools police car. But investigators say the student stabbing suspect may have been defending himself, that those boys approached him in his car near the end of the school day and they started a fight. The three wounded faced charges of burglary and battery. Because that the student who police say used a knife to fight back will be charged with possession of a weapon on school grounds. And all of those charges are felony charges, including for those who are still here in the hospital. We are right now waiting on a condition update. As far as the investigation, Miami-Dade Schools police say they believe what happened is an isolated incident. We're in southwest Miami-Dade. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News. What a day there as well. Uh, Janine, thanks.